Developing news from Simsbury, where we're learning shocking new details about a deadly double shooting. The state medical examiner has confirmed what many had already suspected, that this was a murder-suicide. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Marcy Jones has more and is joining us live right now. Marcy, what is the latest on this really just tragic situation? Absolutely, Aaron and Patricia, you know, the community, as you can imagine, is still reeling from this absolutely shocking incident. It's very safe to say right now that there are way more questions than there are answers. So, of course, everybody is waiting for these details to come in. But for now, the police have identified the two people who were killed as 57-year-old Linda Halligan and 59-year-old Bernard Halligan Jr. Now, according to police, Sunday night at about 5.30, the Halligan's 18-year-old ran to a neighbor's house saying a shooting had taken place inside her home at 6 Woodley Place in the Weetog section of town. Police then rushed to the scene and found Linda Halligan inside the home clinging to life. She was then rushed to St. Francis Hospital where she succumbed to a gunshot wound to the head. The incident prompted a massive police response and a SWAT team was assembled. Ultimately, the search led to the discovery of Bernard Halligan Jr.'s body found in the garage with a self-inflicted gunshot wound. Now, residents say they can't believe the details that they're hearing about this case. It's shocking. I wonder what happened to them, you know, what happened between them. It's a terrible thing. Of course, as that resident of this town just mentioned, the top question on everybody's mind is what exactly went on in these moments leading up to this deadly incident? Of course, we don't have that answer right now, but as soon as any updates come in, we will bring that to you. But for now, that's the latest live in Simsbury. Marcy Jones, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.